What up guys, it's Brooke, <laughs> or Brooke, whatever, and welcome back to my channel. Today is going to be a little haul, I guess. Um, yeah, um, wanted to apologize, I didn't do a vlog on the weekend, um, I think that's going to be like a surprise thing, if I do a vlog on the weekend, um. It's first it'll be surprising to me because weekends are very insane for me and I rarely have time to film. So, yeah. But otherwise, the Monday, Wednesday, and Friday videos, as you can tell the day after day is Monday, those are still going to be uploaded on those days. So, yeah, let's uh, jump around and do it all. First place I went, and this was yesterday, um... Was TJ Maxx. Never been there before. Never been there. I wanted to check it out. First thing that I wanted to get to is something from Philosophy, and they had this the cherry pinwheel cookie flavor. Um, I have a hair in my mouth. That's really gross. It comes with the shampoo. Dash shower gel, a dash of bubble bath combined in one thing, and then a high gloss, high flavored lip shine. That's the packaging. So here's the shower gel, bubble bath, shampoo thing. Ooh, that smells really good. And then, this is the little lip shine thing. So, this was 10 bucks, which is really good. And it's compared at 12. Then, this caught my eye right away. Um, I used to have a lotion that had goat milk in it. And goat milk is very good for your skin, so... I saw this mango and goat milk scented bath soap. It's a vegetable based and gluten free and I could not pass it up. So, packaging. And it really does smell really good. Compared at $6, it's now $3.99. And um, it says on the back, goat milk is great for your skin. Not to mention goats are just really cool. The soap rocks and it smells wicked good. And then this thing I cannot pass up whatsoever. It is one of the body shops. Um, oh my gosh, I keep dropping things. <laughs> uh, get back. Okay, we're good. We're good. One of their uh, soaps. This one is the Brazil Nut one. And it's originally two bucks. I got it for one ninety nine, and I can pass it up. So yeah, that's what I got from TJ Maxx. The other place I went to is Target. The first three, two, three, okay. Well, three things I will be showing are sugar snap peas, because those are my favorite vegetable, and I love snacking on them, so got some of those. I got a blueberry strudel bread, that's what I just had for breakfast not too long ago. Um, and what was the Oh, just some makeup removal wipes from e.l.f. But the rest I uh, have over here are some beauty product projects. Why do I keep saying that? It's products. Right? Okay. Anyways, so I wanted to get this because I have seen a bunch of people having these and I want to try it out. It's one of the Rimmel Scandalize um, eye pencil. Bowie pencil. This one is the number two bulletproof beige. It's just a really pretty gold. And yeah. So that's that. Um, next up, I've been wanting this for a long time. So I finally forced myself to get it. It's 10 bucks, which is really good for a contour, contour concealer palette. And it's a number 8 medium. It's from Sony Kashuk. And. 
you. And yeah. Um, next three, the last three things are foundations because that's one of my things that I'm going to be focusing on now are foundations. So yeah. First thing I got was the CoverGirl Ready Set Gorgeous 1 in 105, which is Classic Ivory, which is the, like, um, palace, hey, okay. can't talk. The lightest shade, I should say, like that. So, that's what that is. So, I had to try that one out. And then, these two foundations are new. This is the Maybelline, one of the Maybelline Fit Me's. It's a matte and poreless one. Excited for that. And then, um... This is the new uh, L'Oreal Infallible um, foundation. It's a pro matte one. And on the back it says it's a demi matte finish, wears up to 24 hours, it's a medium coverage, and it's an air light texture. So, yeah. Got it in 101 Class Gavry. Again, the latest shade. I do for basically all of them. So. Yeah. so that was all for my mini haul. If you guys liked it, give it a big thumbs up if you did. If you guys want to see any of these products reviewed, let me know. I'll probably be doing the Sony Kashuk, the Maybelline Fit Me, the L'Oreal um, Infallible one for sure. Um, but yeah, just let me know if you guys want to review on anything else. And I'll see you guys on Wednesday. Peace out, Press Ghost. See you.